What's up everybody on YouTube? It's your boy Verdugo Vibes here coming at you again with another video. I know that the camera angle is a little bit different today. It's going back to the first new videos where I had this angle, but I have a sneaky review and it is the Adidas Ultra Boost sneaker. Man, let's get straight into the shoe. I mean, I know that everyone is so debatable on the Adidas Nike kind of dilemma, whether you're Nike or Adidas, but I know for a true fact that Adidas is going to kill it from... I mean, they've already killed it from last year onwards with the tubular release and the bringing out like the pure boost with all that new technology in the sole. But, man, they're just freaking killing it. It's unbelievable. So here we have the Ultra Boost. You can see that it's got the boost running along the side of the box and it's got like this honeycomb and white design. I know it reminds me of like a bee, I don't really know why, but I hate bees. You've got the tags right here, so let's get a bit of a close-up. Alright, starting, you can see right here, it's got the Ultra Boost M, and I bought this from another retailer, so it's got Ultra Boost in C, black and gold, US 10, and on the actual sign right here, so there's a little description right here, if you just had that little sneak peek, it says, Boost is unlike anything else. Run in boost for 30 days, and if you're not satisfied, just return them and we'll refund you. But, uh, I mean, I've had these for two days, and I'm really, really satisfied. So, without further ado, let's just get open the box. So, you can have the paper, and here is the silhouette. Bam! Look at that. Man, these are clean. Now, I'll take out both shoes. Just hold on a sec. I'm going to show you the right shirt and all the intricate details and this, that, because I, as I was putting the camera set up, I realized that I scuffed them really badly, as you can see. I mean, I'll wear, I'm wearing these to the gym now, and I must have hit a weight or something and just scraped all the freaking paint off, so I'm so upset, but, I mean, they're just shoes at the end of the day, it's what they're there for, you're supposed to wear them, but let's show the details. So starting off with the silhouette, you can see that it is, I don't know why they call it black and gold. I guess it's because the Ultra Boost is in gold and it's got gold anglets, as you can see right there. Get some close-ups, there you go. If you guys are familiar with the Fly Knit Racers and the Fly Knit Trainers, Adidas have used their own intake on the Prime Knit. So they've used the Prime Knit material going across the upper and along the sides. I don't know if you guys can see with the light, but these, it's got like a black prime knit around the circle and around the toe box, blended in with like this blue purplish um, material. It's really weird, but it's so cool and it's different. Got the three stripes here that's in this like this plastic rubber material, but I, you know, stuffed up the other one. It's just unfortunate. Going on to the back, you can see that this part is raised a little bit, so your like ankle gets a lot more support. What really does it for this shoe is this hint of purple, man. It is It's just, it makes it so clean. Just look at it. It's just a hint of purple that makes this shoe so iconic. Because, like, everyone wants this specific type of Ultra Boost because it's just so clean. Um, I'll get some close-ups on this. You can see the Ultra Boost right there with the hint of purple going around the back of the shoe. And if you can see right there, it's got the Boost name right there along with the sizing and on the inner tag it says in there ultra boost endless energy also you have the adidas symbol right there on the front of the shoe on the toe box so there is also the honeycomb effect on the midsole which is adds a little bit of texture and detail so the outsole is right there it's got the torsion torsion system i don't really know how to pronounce it i'm assuming that's like the technology that they use in it in terms of comfort i can't describe this it is it's a feeling that you can't describe unless you try them on. Like, I know, I mean, a lot of people might have owned like a pair of Flying Racers, Flying Trainers, Lunar Rise, Pure Boost, or anything like that. But this, it, it's like, they say, they say it's like walking on clouds. This is like walking on a baby cloud. That's how freaking crazy it is. I mean, when you put them on and you walk, it's like when you walk, this pushes you off the floor. So you don't even feel the floor at all. I mean, I, I needed a gym shoe, so I thought I'm going to buy this and use them all the time. And I bought this on Saturday and I'm recording it. It's Tuesday and I have not taken this off. I have not. I've 
I'm scared to take them off and put on like another pair of shoes, like some like my Breads or Stan Smiths, because I'm gonna get upset <laughs> of how uncomfortable they are compared to this. But I mean, the price point I pay is two twenty, and a lot of people you thinking, man, you pay two twenty for a running shoe, and. I mean, it is a running shoe, but it is a stylish running shoe, man. You can wear these when you go out. You can wear these to the gym. You can wear them running. You can wear them anywhere. It is so versatile and just a clean silhouette to have. And the story on how I got these, I walked into the Burke Street out of that store. I think it's Burke Street. Well, I can't really remember, to be honest. I don't know my Melbourne streets. But I um, walked into that, out of that store and one of the guys that went that I went to high school with was working and he owns a pair of these and he was wearing them there and he let me try on like a size 9 and I knew they wouldn't fit so I thought stuff it, I'll still try them on anyway and I couldn't get, I could get my foot in but it was super super tight and I asked him, like we talked it up, we, chatted, we had a chat, we caught up on a few things, asked what we were doing and I asked him how do you feel about owning these and what are the terms of comfort when he goes Dude, comfort is an understatement. Like, uh, he goes, I wear them everywhere. And then I just like, looked at his shoe. Like, it was beat up, man. Like, this wasn't white anymore. It was just like brown. But he goes, dude, I wear them everywhere. Uni, gym, everywhere. And it does its it does its job. So, they didn't have my size. I went into Emporium, went to Hype DC, had my size, contemplated for like, at least 15 minutes. I felt sorry for the girl that was working there because she was like, standing there for 10 minutes like, Can you please hurry up and decide, please? Ended up spending it, now I have no money, but I don't care because this is comfort. This is absolute comfort. In terms of sizing guys, you guys know I'm usually a 10 and a half when it comes to shoes. And with this, I got a 10. I tried on the 11 and a 10 because I didn't have a half size, unfortunately. But the 11 was too big, like the, my foot was too short. Like I had a lot of room at the top. So I went with a 10 and I'm happy, man. These, like it does stretch a little bit with the prime knit material at the top. So, man, I reckon just go half a size down if you can. Or if you want, go your true size for that little bit extra room. Before you guys go, I just want to give a quick tip on the Adidas Australia website. I believe there's a few sizes left. I haven't checked since yesterday, as of Monday. So, I mean, if you guys want, quickly check on the Adidas website. And if you want to get these cheaper than 220, because my girlfriend paid 180, so I'm super mad. Um, she got a 15% off code. All you do is you sign up for your email. You can either just make a fake email and just sign up. It's that simple. Um, sign up to the Adidas email newsletter, whatever the hell they call it. They give you a code and the code gives you 15% off everything or anything. So you can get this for at least 180 shipped, which is, you know, it's cheaper than retail, man. I seriously suggest it. Now I'll show you a quick on feet and how they look. Alright, so there you guys have it. Thanks again for watching. Um, I appreciate every single comment and like. I say it's every video, but I really do appreciate you guys. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and follow me on my Twitter and Instagram at Vidugo Vibes. I say this every video, freaking hell. That is the Adidas Ultra Boost in the black and gold. Thanks for watching. I'm out. Peace.